Okay, this is Orlando Wilson. What I want to talk about in this video quickly is advanced work, mainly uh, location reconnaissance. And this is essential. If you're picking up clients, if you're moving clients, if you're going to places, you need to know where you're going. You need to know the details of where you're going. You need to understand the layout of the locations before you get there. Um, this is where a lot of the close protection executive protection business is more to do with planning and preparation and avoiding the issues than the tactical gung-ho stuff, right? But people don't realize that. To me, if you cannot go in and do a, a decent reconnaissance, a decent area check, a decent location check, you're worthless. You're a waste of time. You're just, a, you're just good for following people around and being a goon. Now, when you're checking out a location, it's not just checking out the actual location, it's checking out the area around the location. It's checking out the routes in and out of that location. Now, I've sent people to locations. I'm at an airport now. Um, I used to use MIA in Miami all the time. Send people there, check out one of the arrivals, etc. One of the arrival, one of the arrival gates. And you know what? How many people used to just go in and do a reconnaissance of the actual arrival gate? Nothing about parking, nothing about routes in, routes out, etc. Now, you've got to remember, if somebody's watching you, if somebody's following you, especially at an airport, they not, might not be actually in the airport watching you. They could be in the parking lot watching your car. They could be waiting on the entrance exit points of the airport. And most airports, you're limited on ways in, ways out um, to pick you up and follow you as you're leaving the airport. The other thing with clients, and I've got videos somewhere of some celebrity having issues at, I think it's MIA, um, of what's a decent pickup location what's a decent drop-off location for a client at the airport. And stuff like that is essential, and that needs to be covered on your advanced security, your location reconnaissances, etc. It's, it's common sense to me, but to a lot of people, as they say, common sense isn't that common these days. Also, if we're looking at it from an airport perspective, if somebody's arriving in the country, um, we want to know what facilities are at that airport. I'm at a major airport at the moment. There's a multitude of restaurants. There's a multitude of facilities. Um, I think most clients coming in here could get whatever they wanted at whatever standard they wanted. There's a lot of hotels. Um, this airport has got, has got a lot of facilities, but a client would need to know that. If they need something in specifically, and I say to people, is there a pharmacy? The client could turn up, they need medication or something, they're traveling with children, they might need diapers. Um, they might need a SIM card, they might need a phone. Uh, where do we get that if the client turns up? And we've had it in areas where clients turn up, their phones don't work, so they need to get a local phone to be able to communicate with their people. So this is where when you're doing an area reconnaissance or a location reconnaissance, we're looking for every little detail. Even these days, does, do the restaurants take cash? Do they take cards? What type of cards? Um, if we have a client with dietary issues, uh, they can't eat something. <laughs> Let's say they could be Muslim, they could be Jewish, they don't want to eat pork. Um, okay, are there halal, are there kosher restaurants anywhere near? Where can we take them where they're not going to have issues due to their dietary uh, restrictions? So again, these are just a few things that need to be taken into consideration. And you've got to think about it once you're doing an area reconnaissance. Okay, we start from the outside in. We're starting on, as I said, the approach routes, where along the approach routes could we be, again, ambushed if we're talking. Everybody thinks physical threat, ambushed, etc. But you also want to think, where could we be put under surveillance? Where could, be we, where could we be watched? Where could we park the car? if we don't have a driver with us. Um, so hopefully the car will be safe, secure, and won't have tracking devices put on it, etc. If we're at a busy airport, where can we park the car? So when the clients turn up, if we have a driver, where, okay, we can signal the driver, the driver can be straight in curbside and we're, we're straight out, rather than the driver being parked too far away. It's all, um, it's all things you have to take into consideration.
a lot of it comes with experience but again a lot of it comes from just going to the locations and working out uh, your plans and working out the procedures getting to know the location it helps if you're working in an area let's say you're based in okay I was in as I said South Florida for how many years too long I know the airports there I know Fort Lauderdale well I knew Fort Lauderdale Miami airports I know where we could park I knew the facilities etc client coming in there it's easy the issue one of the issues where your advanced work your reconnaissance work comes in if you're going to locations um, that you don't know then you need to do the planning and prep to ensure to ensure you know how to get around again a major aid these days for your advanced work your reconnaissance work uh, smartphones and also video um, video the areas video the locations take pictures of the again if you're at an airport take pictures of maps of the airport take pictures of the facilities at the airport etc video uh, pictures speak a thousand words video is also excellent because you can video the routes in video the routes out and make it very clear to people where they need to go what they need to do etc if you're picking a client up you can video you can picture take pictures of where you're going to meet that client etc 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 so a little video on advanced work reconnaissance area reconnaissance I've used an airport as an example but again it could be anywhere if you're going to a theater if you're going to a movie theater if you're going to a restaurant the same basics apply you check you check you check drop off pickups surveillance positions ambush positions routes in routes out exits etc etc but a lot of it is uh, down to experience in the meantime follow me along on social media I have an array of books up on Amazon and we also got an array of books up we got a lot of videos up at the moment on YouTube and also Instagram and again if you're connecting me on social media reach out when I have time I will get back to you um, I'm saying we're going to be sorting the courses out again we've been we've had the courses on hold but we should be sorting the courses out in early 2024 uh, we've been slam busy and I mean the courses have taken second place at the moment well the courses have taken uh, unless people are, uh, want to do private courses the public courses have been scrapped really until uh, next year so if you want the course information um, just follow us along on social media reach out and I can stick you on the mailing list and update you when things get going again but in the meantime follow us along on social media read the articles on the blogs read my books and uh, there's a lot of content out there that will give you some tips hints and guidance if you're serious about being in the close protection executive protection business or in the security management business or if I'm at an airport so even in the travel security business so in the meantime be good stay safe stay out, stay out of trouble and remember when you're doing your advanced work when you're doing the reconnaissance work pay attention to detail and I've said it in other videos you want to be planning for the things that you don't think are going to happen because when things go bad it's usually the things you never thought of or you didn't think that were going to happen that happen and screw you up all right be good stay safe stay out of trouble